I want it all! I want it now! Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Today is the day. Um, we have the ice island here. Pinnacle Robotics, as it were. But I ain't gonna go there. I'm just not gonna fucks with it. It's kind of okay. I mean, the Scions only cause enemies to explode, which can be pretty useful. But, I don't want to unfreeze stuff or worry about my dudes freezing. So, we're gonna head into the volcano, where you definitely don't have to worry about freezing. And this is the final mission! Uh, we've secured at least two corporate islands, we've secured three, and the difficulty of the mission scales to your current progress. So hopefully we're progressing pretty well. I've also got two more power that I should be able to spend. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Hmm, what should I do it on, though? Hmm, probably this heavy rocket. Ooh, that would be sexy. And we've also got the uh, Artemis artillery. Plus two damage? God, that's sick. Maybe we should go to the Arctic place. Uh, I don't want to be a liar. Well, let's do it anyways. <laughs> Alright, I changed my mind just on the spot looking at my loadout. So, I hope you can respect both forms of life on this island, organic and mechanical. And there are a lot of mechanical beings on this island, as we will soon see. High threat detected, defend the robots, protect the defense lab. I think we're going to be able to do it, and then we'll be able to get that extra reactor core. And you can't quit in the middle of an island. Once you start it, you've got to complete it. Um, so we'll, we'll do our best to do just that. And uh, let's see. Here we go. Here's the thing. Let's Let's start it up. Mom, look, what's that noise? Pinnacle sent Max. Oh, and we got a time pod. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, boy. Recover the pod. Also protect these these dudes. If we can. And that guy stepped on an ice mine, which is pretty sweet. Oh. Oh. Alright. Things are going pretty well already. I ain't too worried. Alright. Had to take a little break for Din Din. Uh, but... That allowed me to seriously think about what was going to happen next. Honestly, most of the dudes are covered in ice, so I don't have a lot to worry about. I'm going to go over and uh, blast this Scion. That seems like a good plan. I could also um, slide this ice block back to cover the emerging Vec. That might be a good idea. But then, um, yeah, that guy's going to be broken out of the ice. So instead, I'm just going to take the direct damage, the nice easy route... But now my dude can't get through here. Hmm. That might have been a mistake. Well, let's block this enemy and punch this Vec in the face. Yaw, trick! And I'll get my tank as well. I could possibly, uh, just explode him. I got two uses of this thing, I think. So yeah, why not? Just get rid of him. Right off the bat. And, uh, it blew up everything around him, but nothing was around him. I pushed him away from this spider bot. So, we are good to go. Um... Yeah, they only have one Scion, and only one creature's gonna spawn on the next turn. So, no problem. We just have to worry about these icy boys. These icy boys! Let me tell you that. Alright, Scion is uh, hanging out. Wasp is on his way over. Damn, I'm gonna have to move that Wasp for sure. So, that should be relatively easy to do. Relatively fun to do! Let us... Uh, Smash this dude. That'll take care of that. Oh, but I freed these dudes. I didn't even think about it. Crap. All right. Well, I can't move these spider bots by myself, so I just kind of have to uh, hope that they will keep themselves safe. I'll move this wasp out of the way so he doesn't smash that bot. And uh, we can punch this fella in the face. I think that's going to be uh, a good move. All right. We'll see how it goes. I still haven't picked up that time pod, so I need to get on that as soon as possible. Updating tracking routines. More VEC have been added. Oh, God. Why are you guys moving closer? Don't move closer. Oh, fart. All right. So this guy's trying to uh, take out my artillery. I think what's most importantly is this firefly right here that's uh, aiming for the defense lab. Because I want that extra reactor extra juice for my reactor. So let us, uh, let us, let us. Hmm. Yeah, that's difficult. 
I think this is only going to do one damage, so I could put my artillery in the way. And that seems like a good idea. And I could shove this guy back, but that's going to cost me the, the time pod. Huh. Destroyed if damaged or trampled by the enemy. Collect it with a mech or defend it until the mech retreat. Ah, uh, I take that move back. This guy... Hmm. I'm gonna try and move this this wasp off this, these uh, buildings. I want to defend those. And then, uh... Fart. I've also got my, my flamethrower action, but that's... That's not ideal. Uh, let's punch this dude. Mm-hmm. The tank has already moved, though. Ah... He's going to do a ton of damage. Three damage? Ugh, it's going to be so hurty. Yeah, but it'll get rid of this guy as well. I could do something with the uh, the artillery up here. <clears throat> hmm. The artillery can't move very far. I think I'm going to uh, slam this guy down here, let my artillery take some damage. That's fine. This firefly I don't really have to worry about. But this one, I can't really move. I should have I should have thought about it a bit more. But, okay. My tank can take the damage. That's fine. Oh, uh, let's hope. Let's hope everything goes fine. We're going to spawn a couple more enemies on the next turn. That's not going to be good. Oh, boy. Poor little tanky tank. All right. Got a scorpion. And uh, what the hell is that? Oh, those bots are dropping mines. That's pretty cool. I like that. Oh, that guy froze himself. Good jab. Good jab, fella. Hmm. So... Man, I, I still can't collect that pod. I don't want to move my, um, my artillery out of the way. Let's... Hmm. We can do this. That one guy froze himself, so I don't have to worry about him. I'll just take another hit with my artillery. That's going to be fine. Ah, uh, we're going to get taken out by this thing. Unless I can smack it. If I smack it with the, uh... With the, the, the... What is that called? Combat mech. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'll step away for a minute, my mind slips away. Yeah, smack it with the combat mech. That could be fine. I'll move this scorpion off the building with my, uh, my tanky tank. And, yeah, this should work out. I didn't get to heal on this turn, unfortunately, but that's fine. Vec has ceased life operations. Oh, it's the end of the, end of the match as well. So, okay. That's fine. We did the best we could, and it wasn't too bad. I didn't lose any grid defense. Hate to leave those fleeing Vec unaccounted for, but we secured the region. That's right. That's what's important. Protect the defense lab, protect the time pod. Everything's good. I'll take it. We got Abe Isamu. Uh, I think I have that guy already. And then a reactor core. Always sweet. Love them reactor cores. <clears throat> so if I get some extra power, then I will be able to... Um, increase the power of my defense grid, which is really, really nice. Overpower bonus will give me plus two. So maybe I should just go overpower it. Protect the coal plant, end the battle with less than four mech damage. We can do that. All right. Machines frozen, threat very high. I recommend you avoid them. So yeah, those are a laser mech and an artillery mech. I don't really want to unfreeze them. I will if I have to, but um, hopefully we can just kind of push them out of the way. So let's see how it goes. Couple of scorpions and this fucking earth mover guy. Oh, pods coming in. Dang, we got so many pods. Sweet. Oh boy. That guy's going to be hard to move out of the way, isn't he? Well. Oh man. What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do with this shit? Um... I'll blast this dude in the face so my tank doesn't get hit. And... I could just punch this fella. Punch him square in the in the kisser. And then have my artillery mech move him even further. And then I think this guy's also going to get pushed into that ice block. But that will free the laser mech. 
So, it doesn't say that I have to protect those mechs. I could just kill them, but uh, that's another enemy on the screen. So, we'll see how it goes. We shall see how it goes. Oh, we gotta push this guy even further. Alright. That's what we'll do. Yeah. That's probably a bad move to make, so we'll just push that scorpion so he's hitting only the mountain. And, uh, I think this guy's gonna get freed next turn anyways because of this, uh, digger. Create a defensive rock wall before attacking adjacent tiles. Oh, boy. Well, we'll let him do what he do. Do what it do! That's gonna be just fine. I'm, I'm really worried about this guy, most of all. And my tank can blow him up next turn, so... No problem there. Now the artillery mech is freed. Or the, uh, laser mech, rather. He's threatening my dudes. How dare you threaten my dudes! Oh, boy. They're freezing the other guy. This is, this is a mess. Alright, so this guy has, uh, full, full strength. What are we gonna need to do? Let's, uh, well, the power plant's gonna take a hit. I'll be able to blam this guy, but it's probably not ideal. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, we resisted! <laughs> oh, that's good news. That's the good news. Uh, the bad news is I'm going to have to watch out for this, uh, what is it, artillery mech. Well, he only hits those three squares, and it's relatively well telegraphed where he's aiming, so... Let's punch the scorpion in the face. Or should we dash? Can I dash? Yeah, that's what I want to do. Shazam! Oh, uh, That's sweet. That's sweet is what that is. Alright, so we've got this guy with one health. I think I'm going to, um... I'm gonna slam him into the tank. The tank has enough help to to weather that. But then I'll crush the time pod. Oh shit. Hmm. Well, I could just hit him directly, right? Would that be okay? Yeah, that's that's an even better move. Alright. Two vec threats removed. Reason for removals, Pilot Perez. Good job, Pilot Perez. I think he's the only one we have left to level up. He's got one more level up left in him. So, we've still got that time pod protected. That's gonna be pretty nice. We just need to watch out for that dude. He's now on fire, so... Shouldn't be that much of a problem. But I need to get rid of this, um... This fella. He's only got one health, so that should be easy enough. And... Yeah, let's punch this. Bam! Punch it! And I need to get rid of that guy because he's going to cause that enemy to explode. So, get rid of that, and then... I'll fart. Oh, crap! I didn't think it out completely. Well... Shoot. If I just push him back one... I, I can't push him back. Alright, reset the turn. We use this power quite a bit. <laughs> Localized breach! We good. Alright, so this guy's a big threat. I'm gonna knock him out of here. Knock him out the box. Oh, he didn't even explode! What the fuck is that? Alright, I'll move this tank, blow that fella up, and then all I have to worry about is this scorpion that only has one health, so... Blam! Dead! Got him! That's it! Reset was used, but you know what? Everything that's burrowing out is, uh, on fire, so... <laughs> that's good for me! Good for me! Good for me! Alright, let's knock this dude to the side, and I'll go ahead and uh, smack him with this combat mech. Oh, and I can even blow him up with the artillery. Nobody escapes alive! Do you hear me? Vec threat removed. So that artillery is pretty close to max level as well. Hope my family on Archive was watching. I don't know. Maybe so. The Vec are enough of a threat to your survival. I'm sorry that my kind is unwell and providing additional complications. Oh, that's okay. We're still doing the thing. Don't you worry. What do we got? Reactor core? Damn, we got a shit ton of those now. Five available? What? A, what? What? A, what? A, what? Alright. Install extra damage. So now this is doing three damage. That is sexy. 
Uh, plus two damage to the Titan Fist. Damn, I want that too. I want it all! I want it now! Alright, I'll make the artillery, uh, immune. So I can shoot buildings without doing damage to them. Just kind of protect them. That should be helpful. We got the venting field. Freeze and defend both robots. Or thermal dampeners. Well, I'm probably going to end up doing both of these, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's go this way first. And then... Oh, three. So I can do one or the other. I can't get to this second star. Which is unfortunate. So, alright, we'll go to the venting field. <laughs> a little bit too much thinking. Uh, so, we've got a little freeze tank here that's going to be able to freeze these, uh, these evil mechs. So, that should be helpful. We can also use it on enemies once we get the, uh, the main mission accomplished. Vec infestation detected! Help us! Help us, Captain! Alright, so this scorpion's trying to threaten me. Ain't gonna happen. You fucking with the wrong one. So, smack him in the face. Blah! And, oh, does he have a range? Oh, no, that's from, that's from this mech. So we gotta freeze that guy first. I think that's the thing to do. And this guy's just uh, attacking directly my combat mech, which doesn't bother me too much. Uh, yeah, let's move this up and freeze. Attack has been cancelled. Okay, super. What else can we do? I want to get down here so I can try and block some of these Vex spawns. And we'll get rid of that scorpion just because. Because, because! That's only going to do one damage to my combat mech, but it's also going to light it on fire, so... <laughs> I guess we can live with it. That's fine. Alright. Shoot me in the face. That's fine. We good. Don't worry about it. And they've got that explosive scion popping up, which is not going to be good. This scorpion's trying to attack the, uh, the bot that I was... I was, uh, supposed to protect. So let's... Repair this guy first of all. That's gonna be nice. I'll freeze this bot up. Attack cancelled. Sweet. Um. Yeah, I need to move this guy. I also want to kill this explosive scion, but maybe that can wait. Hmm. Well, we can probably move him with the artillery mech, right? I think that's what we're gonna do. So, here we go. And let us scooch this guy one this way. Boop, boop. All right, we safe. We safe for another turn. Oh, man. This is getting hairy. Super hairy. Oh, boy. He wrapped up my artillery mech. This is not good. This is not good. Well, I don't think my little tank... Oh, he can make it. Sweet. Freeze him. Bitch. <laughs> What I say, bitch? Alright, so let's, uh... Move this guy out of the way. Slam. And then... I think we're basically good. Hmm. Just gotta protect my little... My little fellas. Not my balls, but you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'll light this forest on fire. Or no, I should heal. Oh, well, this guy still has enough health to heal. Yeah, I'll just I'll just knock this thing away. Stop thinking so much. You got a pilot by the seat of your pants, dude. You know what I'm saying? And that is a lot of damage. Three damage. Ugh. Good lord. Lordy lord. And I'm being threatened, but that's okay. Everything's fine here. Um, I'm gonna knock this dude. Knock the piss out of him. Knock him into next week. Hmm. Victory in one turn. So now I can move these guys. Okay. So we're fine. We're doing good things. We're doing big stuff. You know what I'm saying. Move that fella. And then move him even once more. Why not? Why not? And that's the turn. I could have also froze him with the tank. But what's the point of that? Come on. Vec Retreat gives us hope, initiating subroutines to track survivors. 
No buildings got knocked down. They all survived. Come on, dude. See, civilians protected. 500. 500! You got it! And, uh, we got lifeless basin, thermal dampeners, central processor. I'll go central processor, I guess. End battle with less than four mech damage, protect emergency batteries, and I will be able to overpower my defense grid, so, uh, it can possibly take even another hit. Let's spawn them just like that. And it seems like, uh, most things are frozen. Oh, no, they're not. <laughs> hey! There's a surprise! I guess I'm supposed to, uh, blow this thing up. It doesn't say that I have to protect it, so I won't! Bam! Get out of here! And I'll push this thing away as well. Good idea. And that's not quite reaching my, my tank, so that's nice. I'm just going to, uh, shove him away just in case, though. Just nice, nice wide berth, you know what I mean? I need to get some more damage for this artillery as well. That would be a good idea. Oh man. They everywhere! So this guy is uh, trying to make some moves. Hmm. I can blam this wasp and that'll push this guy into a, a place where he's not gonna hurt anything. So that's nice. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna bring that combat mech up to punch that other wasp, and that'll kill it. That should be good. Excellent. Vec threat removed! Get out of here! Nobody wanna see you here! And some more are freed. Oh boy! We gotta get that guy for sure. He's gonna attack two buildings at the same time. So, uh... Hmm. Artillery, can you reach down here? Well, no matter what artillery does, he's uh, not going to be able to to get that. So let's let's put him over here. Get rid of this guy first. There you go. And then I'll punch this fella. Yeah, fucking trick. And that guy can go down. Hehehe. <laughs> it's all going according to plan. Yes. All right. So uh, one guy left. We'll just, we'll just slam him in the face. That's what we do now. Thank you so much! Done and done! That was piss easy. I didn't even have to break the ice. They're just kind of freeing themselves. Interesting! Ah, wonderfully done. So, defense up. We got 22% grid defense now, which is super sweet. I also wanted to do something with that extra power core. If I could remember what that is. Hmm... A little bit of extra damage might be nice. We can upgrade the Titan Fist to be a, a four damage punch. That is gonna be sick! But first I gotta protect corporate headquarters, so... Destroy the bot leader, protect the corporate tower. Dang. Look at that boy, he got all kinds of hell. Self-repairing, this unit will shield itself and prepare to heal. Alright, so we gotta take it down quick. Quick and easy! That's how we do things. And, uh, I guess I'll leave my artillery mech up here. Because he can shoot basically anything from this back row. Uh, except for this leftmost grid. But, I don't think anything's gonna be in the leftmost grid. And if it is, then, then we'll figure it out if it happens. We can do it! We can do it! Let's turn the vec into relics! That's right. That's what we gonna do. Dang. And there, uh, a guy headed into the leftmost grid. Well... Shit. Hmm. <laughs> what can Mr. Tanky do? I might have to I might have to take a hit. It might just happen. Hmm. This ain't good. I could punch this dude. That's probably not gonna be the right move. I gotta get this bot off because he's going to uh destroy the corporate tower in no time at all. So Make it happen, Cap'n. And we can do three damage and push this thing out of the way. Oh, man. Three damage over there. That's actually probably, uh, probably what I want to do. Hmm. But then how am I going to get this guy back even more? 
Oh, fart. Okay, reset the turn. I always reset the turn at the start of the battle. A good a good start is uh, extremely important in this game. So, if I can move this guy left, maybe that will work. Hmm. Oh, man. Something's gonna take damage. I can tell you that right now. Ah, but what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be, G? Alright. We'll, uh, scoot this guy a little more. Go ahead and finish him off. That's pretty good. Alright. I did free that bot, but, and a couple of buildings are gonna take damage. Shit, they are gonna level everything over there. That's gonna be four bars of power, and I'm gonna cry. Grid defense, don't fail me now! Oh, there it is. Resisted. Oh, but... <laughs> that time, yeah. Not resisted. That was the important time! Oh, no! Daddy, why? Alright, whatever. We are in quite some shit here. Let's get rid of this guy, I think. That's gonna be the thing to do. Scoochy scooch. Oh man. This is just this is just not going well. Not going well at all. At all. Oh. I can get rid of this guy and free the tank, but then what's gonna happen? All I'm gonna be able to do is protect my, my corporate tower. Fart. This is so bad. I hate it. I hate it. Well, we used the reset, so maybe this is where it all ends. That'll be really shit. Oh, God! Damn it! Ugh! They got me. It can all just change like that. One shit battle and... And it's, it's lost. Game over. So, who are we going to take to the next timeline? Hmm... I guess, uh, Binary's coming with us. Binary's a really, really good one. I like these other two dudes, but I can get them from the hangar at any time. You okay over there? Daughter's coughing up a storm. And farting. <laughs> it's so funny. God damn it. Alright, uh, I guess I'm just gonna take Binary with me. Jill could also be a good choice because they have basically the same, uh, the same level up skills. They're both max level. I'll take the robot. I trust a robot. He keep me safe. So, it was a failure with the Riftwalkers. That sucks. But we'll get them next time. I'll, I'll be back with some more Into the Breach eventually. I hope that you've enjoyed this series, friends. If you did, I hope that you'll like, comment, and or subscribe. Check out our links in the description. We've got links to Patreon, Twitter, Discord. If you'd like to support me on any of those, it would be highly, highly appreciated. Anyways, friends, once again, this has been Into the Breach. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next time. Possibly this game, possibly another. Um, but yeah, until then, friends. Bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.